From the moment we arrived in Nicaragua, we knew we were in a different kind of place. It's very stunning, shocking maybe is another word, how quickly we went from one world to another. But I'm just in a totally different world from the world I'm normally in. From an ecotourism standpoint, it was absolutely wonderful. I was totally amazed. I wasn't entirely prepared for the amount of, you know, forest, wildlife that, that we were exposed to. The idea of creating a strong relationship, an intimate relationship with another community is something that fascinates me. I was in the Peace Corps years ago in Africa and found the meeting people of another culture to be one of the most fascinating things I ever had done in my life. And from that, we came up with the idea of ecotourism because people here are so outgoing and friendly. The first part of the trip, we're living on a beautiful mountaintop in the rainforest and it's wild and it's lovely. Our home base was Finca Esperanza Verde which means Green Hope Farm. The Finca is a model organic shade grown coffee farm. I never knew there was so much to know about coffee. And while we were there we got to plant some coffee trees and work on compost and do some of the work of the farm. It was a lot of fun. <laughs> I love just looking at the views, uh, seeing different uh, flowers. We hiked a good bit and we saw some really exotic animals that you don't have here like leafcutter ants and tree frogs and parrots. It's a breathtakingly beautiful place. We also visited the butterfly house which is made of locally available materials. And there are quite a large number of local people that are very busy bringing in new butterflies and food to feed the butterfly pupa. A group of visiting middle and high school students enjoyed a game of baseball with local children. Run! After baseball, we switched to soccer. And not everyone played, but the spectators had a great time too. <laughs> the uh, trip to see the monkeys was uh, the Monocongo, where it was totally exciting. It was like a total trip through the jungle. Um, to see these amazing animals right, you know, as close as can be. Ecotourism has, uh, is a new and growing industry and it has three main goals. One is that the uh, local environment is improved, not just doesn't get worse, but is actually improved by people coming to visit it. Second is that the local uh, people have a serious stake in not only the work being done, but they own businesses, they participate in the income, and they have a say in what goes on in the business. And the third is that the people who come 
get an appreciation of the local culture and people. Achote preparado. Achote. Achote. The second part of the trip is an opportunity to really live with the family. There is a, a tremendous genuineness, and I would say that's what I find the most um, striking thing about the trip is meeting a lot of these people who are very open and very kind and um, very generous with me. We were helped by a local club of teenage guides who were very knowledgeable about the history of San Ramon and took us to some really beautiful places that we could have never found on our own. Me gusta que los turistas I like it that tourists want to visit such a poor country like Nicaragua and that they want to visit such a poor town like San Ramon. Que es un pueblo muy pobre y yo admiro como los turistas vienen a una familia pobre. I admire how tourists come and live with a poor family in San Ramon and adapt to the family and enjoy living with these poor families. That is truly admirable. They learn from us and we learn from them. There is an exchange of experiences. El turismo ha beneficiado en muchos aspectos a la comunidad. The community has benefited from tourism in many ways. In getting to know a different culture, the North American culture. The exchange of cultures between the tourists that come to visit and the hosting families is visible. It has been a positive experience in this respect. And uh, so that's, that was the idea, to get people as much of, a, of an immersion as, as we could in this one week and still also preserve the, 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 the pace of life here. Sometimes I think about how I'm going to tell the people back home when I get back home about this trip. And I kept thinking um, like, that this is the best thing that I've ever done. It was, it was really one of the most enriching getting the, the, uh, things that I'd ever done. And both on, in, in so many ways, on, in a social way, in an um, uh, ecological kind of way, an ecotourist kind of way, all these things. It feels like totally positive. I, 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 haven't, I, I think I haven't ever felt quite so positive about a trip that I have about this one.